you guys. Welcome back to Walmart Wednesday. Let's get right into it, you guys. You know I showed you this dress in black corduroy a few weeks ago. I found it in this gorgeous black and red gingham, you guys. Holiday season is coming. It's October, yes, but it will be November, and then you know how it goes after that. Check this out, you guys. All right, so I am wearing the slouch boots. You guys want to crack right up. I think I've been calling them scrunch boots. <laughs> I was looking on the website. I'm like, why am I calling them scrunch boots? It's slouch boots. These are the black slouch boots. So make sure you use my link below, you guys. Someone was saying how the black was out of stock, so they had to buy the green. They're talking about a different pair of slouch boots. So there are two pairs. These are the time and true. They're both time and true, but these are the more casual version. Now, let me just tell you, these are from last year. I actually like the newer style, which I will link below, better from this year. They go up a little higher. There's more detail and structure to them. I actually might get them, even though I have these. The brown boots are the newer version. So yeah, these are just a little different. I think you guys will like this year's better. Um, but anyway, I paired this cute gingham dress with these boots. Grabbed, of course, my hobo bag. Yes, the tag is still on. You guys, I'm busy, all right? I haven't cut tags on a lot of things. <laughs> But I love this little detail. It's got the back pocket. You guys will love it. It's gonna be the black purse I keep pulling out for all the outfits that call for it. But I added my scoop belt to this, you guys. Now, I figured I'd show that for those of you who like things more fitted or you like to flatter your figure by showing off your waist. This is the scoop, whoops, faux croc belt. I've shown you guys this so many times and I've told you. You will use this constantly, and I have over the past year. But you don't have to wear it that way. This is a drop waist, just like the black corduroy one I showed you, dress. Now, we're getting beams of sunlight, which I appreciate, but not when I'm doing a video. <laughs> um, so this is the drop waist, you guys, and it does not have to be form-fitting. I was even thinking you can wear black leggings, full leather leggings underneath it if you wanted to. Of course, black tights. Now, on me, it always goes down a little bit more in the back. I don't know, again, I bought the small in this. Some of you thought I needed the extra small in the black, so maybe I actually do, so it won't hang that way. But I do love, love, love the belt with this, just because I think for my body type, I look better if my waist is accentuated. That's just how I feel. And then in the back, here's what it would look like with the belt. I love the color combo. It's really cute, very festive for holidays. It's nice and bright, you guys. I tried so hard to wear red lipstick. <laughs> Can't do it. It just does not look good. <laughs> I tried, I'm like, they're gonna kill me. They're gonna want me to wear red lipstick. Someone's gonna write it in the comments. Let me just put it on. I put it on. I was walking around. I'm like, okay, this isn't too bad. Right before we turned the camera on, boom. I had to change lipstick. Let's go over the jewelry. I've got my uh, bracelets from Target, my one ring that I absolutely love from the Target trio of rings, this one here. You know, there are a few now. Um, I've been wearing these constantly, my gold octagon hoops from Walmart. And I really love the way this all looks, you guys. I have several more things to show you, so I'm gonna try and prevent myself from talking too much today. So let's get to the next outfit. Guys, I am back with my next outfit. This one is awesome. If you're not following me over on Instagram, go over there. It's just at Life and Style by Liz. I just made a reel in this and I used a Britney Spears songs. I had a great time. Song, not songs. Anyway, check this out. Do you guys remember, and I know you do, the juicy suits from the early 2000s? Thousands? Why am I not using my plurals and singulars properly today? Anyway, you guys, this is by Avia. It is the athletic, one of the athletic brands over at Walmart. And I happened to be walking through and I saw these flare leg pants, which I love. Check out the back. Oh, yes. So they're really cute. They're not super long, so you actually can wear them if you go out and walk, etc., etc. I thought that this whole outfit, by the way, this is the coordinating, coordinating jacket. They did not have it in store, but your girl got it online. I said, I need a full outfit now. We're not going to do this, you know, all PC. Uh, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, I thought that this outfit would be great for the holidays as far as shopping. We all do more shopping. You can't do everything online. You know how that goes. So if you're running out to get wrapping paper, gifts, groceries, decor for your home, pick up your Christmas tree, 
I don't know, whatever tradition that you do and you've got to run around to do it, even Thanksgiving, cooking, shopping, whatever, taking your kids out trick-or-treating, Halloween's still a holiday and coming up, sort of a holiday, I guess, right? This outfit is awesome for all of that. High-waisted pants, flare leg at the bottom, cute little crop jacket. I'm wearing everything in a size small. I have the tag right here. I just took it off the jacket, size small. And I feel like I have plenty of room. I don't feel like I have lumps or bumps. I feel like I got a nice bootay in this outfit. You guys let me know what you think or don't. It's okay. You guys are like, what? <laughs> and these comfy, adorable shoes that I'm walking around in, you guys, are by a company called Vibea. They are Vibea underscore official over on Instagram. They asked me to try out their shoes and let you guys know what I thought. Not sponsored, just showing you that I love them. I've worn them several times, you can tell. I already had to clean them uh, with some wipes to walk around my bedroom in them. They're awesome. It's like wearing sneakers. The comfort is second to none, honestly. Uh, you guys know I like things that are comfy. So this is the cute little leopard print. I'll link which ones I have on below in the description box so you'll get the website, my affiliate link, etc. cetera. I also have a discount code, you guys, that I keep forgetting, it's 10% off. So I will make sure that you guys get that discount code and make sure you check out their Instagram to see all their different styles. I have another pair I need to show you. Hopefully I can incorporate them into today's haul. Certainly wouldn't go with this. They're a cute little square heeled pump and they have the cutest little bows that are removable. So if I don't wear an outfit with them, I will make sure to bring them out here and show you. All right, you guys, now let me show you another way you can style this cute running around little velour jogger set. This jogger set does, by the way, come in other colors. There's a really, really pretty muted purple, just getting my boots on over here, you guys, sorry, that I think you all would absolutely love. If I remember, I will put a picture up for you. And black, of course, you know, I had to get the black. But anyway, you guys remember this from last week, the cute little bucket bag, tiny little guy from No Boundaries. It's very festive looking to me. Great for running around because it's crossbody. And then I've got on the off-white cowboy boots as well. So this is another way to wear it. If you want to wear it with sneakers, go right ahead. If you go to yoga or something like that, wear your sports bra, these pants, the jacket comes on and off. They do have an option for an over-the-head, like a pullover jacket to go with this. I'm kind of a fan of those. I like the zipper, so I don't have to pull it over my head. You know, I wear a little makeup got a little bit of hair going on, etc. So for me, the zipper has always been easier. All right, you guys, let's get to the next outfit. I am back with my next outfit. I try not to say you guys or hey, you guys are all right, guys. I loved all your comments, by the way, from last week's Walmart Wednesday video. That was so fun for me. Anyway, let's get into this next outfit. Okay, carrying the adorable little ruched baguette by Scoop. You know we love it with that um, what do I call it? Muted gold hardware and my small gold medallion necklace. I did switch to the other trio of rings from Target, same bracelets, uh, long gold diamond earrings. You guys, I wear these all the time. I think they're so, so pretty. Anyway, this is that BCBG blouse. It, uh, is like elbow length gathers right here. It's got a crisscross. There is a snap right here, so it's not going to get any lower than this as the night goes on. And then, of course, the side tie. It is cropped. I am also wearing it with, by the way, there is a matching skirt. I'll put a picture up here for you if you're interested. It's a really cute set. Many of you have commented that you own the set and love it. I love this color too, you guys. I can't even describe what it is. It's almost pumpkin colored, right? <laughs> Check out these pants, though. These pants are by, you know I forgot. Hold up, I think it's Celebrity Pink. Um, yes, Celebrity Pink, these are the High Rise Flare. And the best part is they are, are they velvet? They're velvet, sort of. <laughs> Give you a disclaimer here. Here's your resident influencer. They're velvet, sort of. <laughs> but seriously, they're almost like a really, really tiny, tiny corduroy that gives them the appearance of velvet because you don't see the lines that you typically see, the rows of however they sew corduroy. So in between a velvet and a corduroy. I love that they're high-waisted. They're not super high though. They're, they would almost be a mid-rise, I would say. They don't go past my belly button. They just meet it. They're flare and they're in a five pocket styling. So you get pockets back here, just like a pair of jeans. 
They're not super long, I noticed, as far as the length. Let me take my shoes off and show you. If I had to guess, I would say they're between a 30 and a 31 inch on the inseam. But keep in mind, even though I'm only 5'5", five five, I'm mostly legs. I know, weird. I could never figure it out. In fact, I remember being in Learners. You guys remember? Comment below. Learners, it wasn't that long ago. I think it was like like 10 years ago that, you know, it was more popular than it is now. Now it's New York and company. Anyway, uh, the associate there was like sort of saying, you don't need this length. I'm taller than you and I wear the short. Well, it depends on your leg length and that always stuck out for some reason. Wearing the cute scoop comfy clogs that look like my Tom McCann's from the 70s. You guys also enjoyed that. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, go over to the community tab under my channel on YouTube and you'll see I put up a post about my clogs and these current ones, which are so, so comfy, you guys. So here's one last look at the entire outfit. I absolutely love it. I love these corduroys a lot. I really do. There's stretch in them, um, plenty of room in the waist. By the way, I'm wearing them in a size seven. I think I told you the dress was a size small and then the shirt is a size small as well. But I have plenty of room as you can see here all the way around. They're very forgiving. I love that stretch, you guys. I have a pair of pants that have no stretch in them which nowadays that's highly unusual. And I wore them to work and I could not wait to get them off. I hate to say it because they're gorgeous. I love them, but you know, gotta be comfy too, right? All right, let's get to the next outfit. All right, guys, I'm back with my next holiday look. How cute is this? You guys, I saw this hanging on the rack. I'm like, oh, we're getting that. They're gonna love that because I'm not like a holiday sweater person by any stretch. Don't give me the Christmas lights and the fringe and all that stuff, but it's nice and neutral. It goes along with Liz's palette. You know your girl loves her neutrals. That was for you guys. <laughs> One of my famous lines, right? Anyway, it's gray, kind of like almost like that tweed look. And it's got the cute little skulls and the skulls are happy. So I'm good with that. It's cropped. I'm wearing it in a small. It's by No Boundaries. Paired it with my Sofia Vergara Melissa Flare high rise jeans. You guys know I love these. I have the button fly in this pair as well. Here's the back, always looking good. Thank you, Melissa. And here's how the sweater hits. So I just paired this very casually with, if you're going to a Halloween party or any kind of event with these mules that I got from Amazon that I can link for you below. Remember these are a dupe for the Madewell. They look exactly like them to me anyway. Um, what was I gonna say? I don't know. I just think this sweater is so cute. I'm gonna wear it to work. I will wear it with black pants. Uh, I'm just showing you a casual way to wear it with jeans, but I was going to say if you're taking someone to a Halloween party, not necessary, or if you're, you're not dressing up. Not everyone wants to dress up on Halloween. Some people don't like to. So if you want to still look festive, get this. And honestly, this is something that you can wear. It's a holiday sweater that you can wear anytime because skulls are kind of like a fashionable thing as well, I think. So here is the last look at this cute little casual Halloween outfit. I had to throw something in there. I'm certainly not gonna come out in costume, but I did wanna show you something for Halloween. All right, I think my next outfit you're gonna love. I don't know what it is, but make sure you stick around for the lip combo because that's coming up too. Okay, back with my next holiday look, you guys. Now keep in mind, I'm labeling these holiday looks just because, you know, I think I get creative and I come up with these themes, but they are looks for every day. It's up to you how you want to style them. Wearing my tiny little heart pendant that I absolutely love. I like to wear this necklace, it's very delicate. When I have something bold, like I do on below, so I have a necklace on, but it's not, you know, dominating my whole look. Same jewelry otherwise, I didn't even put my bracelets back on. This bodysuit, you guys, was like $15 from Target. It's by Universal Thread. It's nice and forgiving. It's almost in, I would say, what do they call it, like comfort fit or something, or relaxed fit, that's it, comfort and relaxed. Um, so it's not one of those skin tight form fitting body suits, it's form fitting, but you get the idea. Anyway, let's get to these holiday pants, you guys. How cute are these? That's something else I say all the time. But seriously, they're like ankle length, they're a mid to a high rise, I'm wearing them in a size four, there's plenty of stretch, they fit very well. In fact, these are the same pants that I've shown you since way back, I believe in August, when I was in the dressing room and I showed you that little khaki pair of pants, and then they came in a black and white gingham. Well, now they recently brought out this plaid. The plaid has green 
and red in it and yellow and black and white. It's kind of like a scotch plaid. Is that what it's called? Go ahead, correct me because I'm probably wrong. And I love it. I paired them with this belt that I got from No Boundaries. I'm sorry, from Walmart. It's No Boundaries. It's got gold grommets on it. I couldn't pull it really tight. The only thing I don't like about the grommets is that you can't get it very precise. So you kind of have to wear it loose or tight depending on where it falls, but it's so cute. And I thought that shiny gold really made this look like a holiday outfit. Here is the back of the pants. Nice and stretchy, like I said. I just love this plaid, you guys. There's something festive about plaid and plaid is hot right now. I think this is the third pair of similar type pants. I have the flare ones by Free Assembly that I love that are also in kind of a holiday plaid. You could pull those out as well. Now I'm wearing another pair of shoes by Vivea, just like sneakers, you guys, but these are a heel, pointy toe on this one, still very, very comfortable, I promise you. It's unbelievable. And remember I told you about the little bows they sent? Now, it doesn't really go with this outfit, but look at this. It's like a little clip. You just clip it right on to the toe. How cute. Let me back up. I don't think I've done it and had them on my feet just yet. OMG, I am Princess Kate right now, you guys. I mean, really, who am I? So, so adorable. So that is another option in the shoes that they have. I believe they have boots as well. So stinking cute. So go on by Bea, use my 10% discount code. I promise you, you will be grateful. And then you'll be like, in the comments, Liz, those are so comfortable. I feel like I can run in them. I'll be like, I know, I know. All right, guys, let's get to this lip combo. Today I have used my boy, totally toffee. Whoops, pulled the wrong end off. And maybe it's a girl, right? Lined the usual way, still loving the lips. I feel like they've calmed down a bit. Then I came in with L'Oreal and I Create. Um, I'm not even sure what kind this is. It's like a hydrating matte, I think. Look how pretty that is. I really like that color. I create is the color. I think it is maybe not a hydrating matte, just a matte, which is fine. It's not the kind that gets feathery and dry and like glue at the end of the day. But with those, I like to come in with something a little more moisturizing in my center highlight. So I brought out the, what is this called? Glow Paradise in the color Beige Eden, also by L'Oreal. This one I love because it's almost like a lip balm and a lipstick. So I just went in and added a little highlight in the center in moisture without being a gloss. Guys, I get too excited when, is that another thing I say? <laughs> when I come up with a lip combo like this, isn't that so cool? In there. All right, you guys, if you did like today's video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel and helps other people to find me. And if you've not already, please subscribe to my channel and hit that bell for notifications. That way you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. I hope you all have a great week and I'll talk to you soon.